Following the escalating HIV infection rates in Uganda, many up to now wonder why, considering the many organizations in the fight against HIV with almost all preventive measures in place. Of late, many have blamed it on the messages, while others say some Ugandans seem to have forgotten so easily, while others only regret after they've fallen victims. A latest survey by Amical Uganda, a non-governmental organization, reveals that the high infections, especially among its employees, is, is a result of fear to lose jobs, promotions, and other opportunities. This, according to Amical Country Director Dr. John Mugisa, people shun testing services due to long queues where even free services are being offered as some fear to be seen going for these tests. So there is complacency because people know there is treatment, but we need to emphasize that there is no cure for HIV AIDS. So because there are drugs, it's not like in the past whereby people, if they knew if I catch AIDS, I'm dying tomorrow. This, as Kampala Capital City Authority partnered with various organizations to sensitize Kampala residents on the dangers of living with HIV AIDS. And you know commercial sex workers tend to be associated with urban settings. They are there. We know that people actually go to them, both married and unmarried. And we are saying that how do we target them? If they are the drivers, we need to target them and reach out to them such that you can actually be able to get a service. However, players in the fight against HIV AIDS says the figures do not reflect the true pictures of what is on ground, saying the infection rates are high among gays, sexual workers, fishermen, border border cyclists, police and prisons. The figures that have been highlighted by the cases a report that has been you know, disseminated today are uh, not actually true. Uh, we have worked with these key populations, especially men who have sex with men, for several years as an organization. And the figure is above 500. So when they say the figure is 200, the study that was carried in five divisions of Kampala with consultations from a wide range of stakeholders indicate that the virus is on the rise, thus the need for urgent preventive measures. Zamzam Siraj, WBS News, Kampala.